Hi, Kevin McCaffrey here from Conversion Rate Services. Today I want to show you how you can add a goal to your Google Analytics account to track visits to the Contact Us page. If you go to your Contact Us page, you'll see the URL similar to this, your website, .com slash contact us or contact contacts, something like that. So that's the page that we want to track in Google Analytics. So if we go over to our Google Analytics account, click Admin, click Goals, click New Goal, then we give this goal a name. Contact us. Then we want to choose a destination and click Next Step. So step two is goal details, and it's asking us for the for the destination. So if we go back and look at what the end of our URL, which is this, after the .com or .co.uk or .ie, we just copy that piece and place it in here. You can select a value, which I suggest that you do. And the value is really the value uh, of each visit to the Contact Us page. How can you work that out? Well, if you consider in a month, you may make £10,000 from traffic from your website. You could work it out by calculating 10,000 divided by the number of visits to the Contact Us page in the last month. So if we had 50 visits to the Contact Us page in the last month, we can work out 10,000 divided by 50 would be 200. This number in itself isn't so important, but it, what it helps us do is calculate how much each traffic source we pay for is worth. So if we're using Google AdWords, SEO, efforts or email marketing, we can compare each based on that value. For the Contact Us goal, there's no real funnel. There are pages that come before a visit to the Contact Us page, but we maybe don't count them as a funnel. So we can leave that option to off. If we click verify this goal, we should see some data in there. And if we don't, then there may be an issue with the settings we've made up above. If you have any uh, problems with this, please contact me at kevin at conversion-rate-services.com. By clicking create goal, that's the end of this process. Say I've set up some of these already. We can see that for one goal, we've seen five conversions in the last seven days. If we go into reporting and look at acquisition and look at all traffic, we should be able to see the conversion rate for each traffic source the number of completions for each traffic source and what that value is worth. In this case, I had set the value to one pound. And as you can see, it gives me an opportunity to compare different traffic sources to understand what they're worth to my business.